Hey guys, it's WT here from the Coin Alley, and yes, I know it's been a long time since my last video update. I'll tell you a little bit what I've been doing since uh, the last update, which I believe was about six months ago. And in this update, I'll be telling you guys about the new exchange within the Trezor wallet. All this coming up next. Let's do it. And we're back. It is Monday, October 22nd, and welcome to the Coin Alley. So I know that it has been a while since my last update. Actually, it's been about six months, I believe, since my last update. Since my last update was six months ago. Um, initially, when I started out my, my um, YouTube channel, I was on a sabbatical of, of some sort. I had taken time off from work. I've actually been off work for about a couple of years. So, you know, I've had a lot of time to travel and do all these extracurricular things like creating a YouTube channel and all that stuff. Now, um, after the whole climate changed uh, at the start of the new year or the end of last year, you know, I decided that I was going to go back into the workforce. So, uh, since December of last year, I started working full time again, um, and that has consumed my my time uh, tremendously initially. So um, that is why I hadn't created any uh, content on um, on YouTube. So you haven't seen any of my uh, videos. But I really wanted to thank all the all the new subscribers. Um, over the last few months, I've received notification of a lot of. Uh, new people joining, enjoying a lot of the old content that I've put out there. I've also had a lot of emails and messages from a lot of you asking about the channel, um, will you be returning, and uh, what's the future of the channel. Uh, to answer that question, uh, at this point, um, I am going to commit to you know, putting out a few updates uh, per month. Uh, if you do get more than a few updates per month, then certainly that would be a bonus for you. But um, at this time, I'm not able to commit to weekly updates. Now, you, there might be some weeks where you might get an update or a couple updates, uh, but those would be rare if there is anything that is somewhat uh, newsworthy in, in the way of crypto or, or cryptocurrency or what have you. So um, my commitment going forward is to post a few updates per month. Um, I won't be having that long of a hiatus um, like I did a few months back, um, but I really appreciate those of you who are still uh, following the channel and are out there. So really, thank you guys uh, for still being uh, for still hanging in there uh, with the Coin Alley. So today I am going to talk to you guys about. Um, everyone knows that I am a holder of the Trezor wallet, so I got an email that Trezor. Um, now has um, an exchange. Well, it's not their exchange, but they're incorporating um, Shapeshift and Chain Jelly within the uh, the Trezor uh, platform or the Trezor ecosystem or the Trezor interface, so to speak. So it says here, you won't need to look for an exchange anymore. It is in your Trezor wallet. So they're offering you the usability, the convenience, the safety. Um, you know, this will allow you to exchange your currency within the wallet without having to go elsewhere. So today, if you wanted to, let's say, exchange your Bitcoin into Litecoin or your Bitcoin into Ethereum or whatever, you would have to transfer your, your cryptocurrency from your wallet to an exchange. And then from there, you can do the, uh, the, uh, the swap. Or if you were to use perhaps change, uh, change Jelly or, or Shapeshift, uh, you would uh, have to go to, to that website, enter your information, what you're looking to buy, what you're offering, and then do the exchange. So what I'm going to show you guys today is the uh, they have a manual that shows you how to do this. It's a step-by-step -step manual that goes through the process of actually exchanging your cryptocurrency. And then um, after I go through the manual, what I'll do is I'll actually go ahead and um, do a little hands-on um, 
I'll show you how to do it uh, with a step-by-step -step process. And I haven't done this yet, so definitely bear with me. So we're going to learn together. So if we encounter any type of issues, then we'll all experience it at the same time uh, during the demo. So what does this mean, it says? In addition to the current features like multiple accounts, multi-currency, complete transaction history, sending and receiving, you can also conveniently exchange coins and tokens directly in your wallet. So as I mentioned, here's a step-by-step. -step. Uh, you select the currency that you're looking to sell from your account. There's an exchange tab, which is a new option. And then there is the uh, exchange option here in the middle. Tells you a little bit about Change Jelly. So if you're not familiar with Change Jelly, uh, you can read up about Change Jelly. And also there is Shape Shift. So both of these are industry leading um, blockchain technology companies um, that allows you to easily um, convert your cryptocurrency. Um, so, and then there's a little bit of information here at the bottom about the um, um, what they're offering. Now you can get the Trezor Model T. It is now available in the Trezor store. All right, so let's get started. All right, so here we are. I'm inside of my Trezor wallet, and we're going to be working with uh, a little bit of Bitcoin here. So we'll click on the exchange. And here's a little disclaimer. Exchange services are offered by third parties. Trezor bears no responsibility for any part of the exchange process, including but limited to functionality and rates. So, you know, that's their CYA. All right. So we've selected. Um, we've acknowledged the disclaimer. And we're going to be purchasing Ethereum Classic. All right, and then we're going to copy the address, which I just did. And we're going to sell all of our BTC. So it'll automatically calculate uh, your BTC less fees. And then down here, you have two matching offers. So here's our first offer from Shapeshift. So after all fees, you receive about 24.6682 Ethereum Classic. And here's your offer from Chain Jelly. And so there's a little message here that says additional fee will apply. All right. So I think this will be a better offer right here. I'm going to go with the 24.669. Um, now over here, you can also purchase Bitcoin with some other vendors that they're offering down here. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and click confirm trade with Shapeshift. Now I need to enter my pin code on my Trezor. So we'll go ahead and enter our pin code. And then I need to confirm the transaction here on Trezor. And it says it's sending. It's doing this little thing right here. I'm guessing this is the approximate time that it'll take for the, the transaction to go through. It says we're about 45 minutes. Now the more details button will give you information about the transaction. So it'll take you over to the the website, which is Shapeshift, where Shapeshift will show you uh, the transaction that is in process. Still sending here. I'm going to pause the video for a little bit, see what happens with the transaction, and then we'll return once it has completed. Okay. All right. So here you go. Our um, Ethereum Classic has been uh, exchanged, or Bitcoin has been exchanged uh, to Ethereum Classic. 
there's our confirmation here on the Shapeshift uh, website. Let me go back to uh, Trezor. Trezor says it's still sending, um, but I'm, I'm assuming that will just stay that way, and then you just have to go and get your uh, update over here. Now I'm going to go to my Ethereum Classic wallet that we have set up for this uh, transaction here, or for this example, and we'll see what happens. Um, haven't received it yet, so we'll check back to see if it has arrived, um, but I'll check the um, the uh, transaction here. There should be a hash that we can uh, check to see what the actual status is of that uh, exchange. Now when I click on exchange again, it tells me that the trade was a success. So that's updated here on your Trezor. So that's also your confirmation that it did uh, execute. And I just refreshed my um, tracker on the ETC network. And here it is, there's the block. Two minutes ago, 24.669 Ethereum Classic is on its way in. We can explore it a little bit further here um, by clicking on that for more information. So that was pretty simple. Um, guys, thank you so much for, for tuning in uh, and checking out this tutorial on how to um, use the exchange within Trezor and how to purchase um, or how to swap your currencies. And if you found this video to be useful, as always, I would certainly appreciate a thumbs up. Please comment if you like the video, and I will certainly uh, be sure to respond back to your comments as soon as I'm available. All right, guys, thank you once again. Thank you for sticking in there. If you're new to the Coin Alley, please thank you and welcome uh, for joining the channel. Please consider subscribing. Um, as I mentioned, I'll be uh, posting uh, new updates going forward uh, a few times a month, so please hang in there. And uh, until our next video, take care of yourself and, of course, each other.